What's up YouTubers, this is Head of Dragon coming at you with another video. Now I know you guys have seen my other post video, you know, my re uh, review of my uh, fitness product review video and I know you guys want to know how is it that you can do one handed push ups. Well, in this video, I will show you guys how you can do it. But I forgot one thing. See what I mean? Even my video forgot. Yep, well I gotta get some. Good to be back. Now guys, in this video, I'm going to have to get as real as I can get. Doing one-handed push-ups takes a time, it takes a while. Not unless you could do it in five minutes or maybe you could do it in five seconds, but this takes time for you to build up. Okay, it's building up your upper body strength, your core muscles, your whole body is working into it, not just your arms. So let's go ahead and get into it, shall we? Let me go, guys. <laughs> I know I can't speak. Anyway, let me show you guys how to do it one way. Now, first off, when you're doing the one-handed push-up, you gotta make sure your arm is straight, okay? Now, when your arm is straight, don't go like bending your arm down like this or bending your arm, arm like this. That's not doing the push-up, and don't go down like this. That's not a push-up, you're not moving your arm. You gotta make sure your arm goes all the way down. Now, here's a practice way you guys can do it. You can do it step by step. Go, keep going this like this. Here comes my dog, Oreo. Hey boy, oh God, he's gonna lick me. Oh God, he lit me. Oh, he lit my face. That was an awkward moment. And he kicked my Kakui nutshells, pun intended. <laughs> anyway, you guys practice that and bring yourself back up with the work of a push up. So, one, two, three, back up. One, two, three, back up. Now, practice that on both sides. So that way you won't have only just one sided that's stronger than the other side. We already know you're already right handed or you're left handed or you're like me ambidextrous. So let's just not try to show off on one side, okay? Make both your side. Oh, sorry. Had a burrito. <laughs> anyway, let's go ahead and do the other workout or at least the other type of way you can get this done. The other one, believe it or not, are called diamond push ups. And yeah, diamond push-ups, regular push-ups, like what you do with your hand, going this way. You know, get in this position, going down, up, down, up, up, down, can't even tell. One, up, down, up, down. It's windy out here, but I love it. Up, down. Now, let you guys know about this one. This type of technique can help you guys build up your muscles within the chest or the pectoral area. And trust me, your pectorals get involved a lot with this type of technique. Can't with my face. Anyway, don't worry about like you guys trying to do as fast as I can. Remember, slow city wins the race. Be sure to when you do this, you don't want to make sure that your hands are too far apart to each other. You want to make sure your hands are like in a diamond shape. This helps you guys build up the muscles you can in the basically inside here. All right, that's all you need to go. All we go down. Now for the next one, another thing, and here's my other dog cooking. And another thing. And you guys are doing these workouts, be sure when you're going into a one-handed push-up, you also got to do some butt clenching. Yes, booty clenching. No pun intended on that part. But other than that, you guys got to make sure that you are using your entire body when you're doing this. So I'm going to go ahead and do a demonstration of a one-handed push-up. This view, keep your legs spread apart, wide as you can get them. Hand behind the back or butt or back, whatever. As long as this hand's not touching the ground. Then go straight down and back up. Be sure to breathe too. Down and up. Other side. Down and up. Down and up. All right. Now, I know it made it look, made it look easy, but believe me, it is a lot, a lot powerfully strong and painful as it seems, especially if you're not used to doing it. Now, I want to say you guys say, oh, you can do it. I can just go straight to it and just completely fall. No, let's go ahead and do the other type of workout I'm thinking about. Plus, let me show you guys, let me, before I go to the other type of workout, let me go ahead and show you guys the one-handed push-up in this view, all right? So, no hand, straight down, pull back up, other hand. This would be a great exercise too, by the way.
Now, since I just showed off, obviously in front of these car thugs, I'm like, bye. Let's go into the workout I was talking about. Which is, believe it or not, explosive push-ups. These help you with your entire upper body strength workout. This helps boost up your, I am so tired, I'm sorry. This helps boost up your biceps, your triceps, and your pectoral areas. It helps work out, especially if you know how to do the certain push-ups, which is basically including the one I did in my helping hand video. Check that out, by the way. And what you need to do, basically do like a regular push-up and then pop into a wide push-up and then to a diamond shape push-up. So let me do it for a demonstration. Move it, I want to break this. Feet together, you already know how to do it. Regular, push, wide, diamond, regular. Now, I know you guys are wondering how many times I'm supposed to do this. Well, I should have said that in my beginning video, but I was too busy so focused on this nature. By the way, it's beautiful out here. Well, what are you supposed to do? Now, for the first one, I want you guys to do at least to your best, to your utmost best, on both sides, 10, and work your way up to 30. All right? Same goes to the second one, 10. Work your way up to 30. This one, 10. Work your way up to 30. Now, I don't mean you guys do something like one, two, three, one, two, no. I want you guys to go like this. One, that counts as one. <sighs> Thought I was having fun out here. <laughs> Anyway, this will be a short video. I uh, hope you guys understand the fundamentals of doing a one-handed push-up. Hope you guys do well. Tell me how many you do, like, especially if you guys do it. By the way, I know you're wondering how wide your legs supposed to be when you're doing a one-handed push-up. Make sure your legs are as wide as your shoulders, if not wider. It helps get the good balance within your body. So if you do like a one-handed push-up with your legs together, odds are one of your feet might be coming up. Instead of looking like a one-handed push-up, look like a one-handed, one-legged push-up. You don't wanna do that. So, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Like, comment, share, subscribe. Follow me on my social medias and whatnot. And, uh, hope you guys have a nice day. <laughs> it's a beautiful, blessed day besides. Also, get outside, go outside. Put down that phone. Well. Follow me first, then put down that phone. <laughs> uh, go outside, have fun. Go on the internet outside while you're having fun and stuff like that. Let the wind go through your hair like it's going through mine. But other than that, I hope you guys have a nice, fun, beautiful, blessed day. It's a sunny day, have fun. Get out there, get active, stay positive, stay healthy. And if you guys want any other tutorial videos, you guys know where to find me. You guys know how to subscribe to me. You guys want any updates on my new videos coming up? Look me up, Hedemius underscore dragon. If you don't believe me, it's right here. Anyway, I hope you guys have a nice day. Once again, bye bye. Bye. Love. Yeah. yeah. Dang, guys, I almost forgot. We need. I forgot another thing. It's also an explosive push-up. It's a clapping push-up. You guys know how to do the clap push-ups? Like this. This helps out a lot. Especially if you want to get up to doing this and go down. And doing this. Other side. Down. Back up. Down. Back up. This will help out a lot, guys. But anyway, hope you guys have a nice time. Ah, peace.